Hello everyone! In this video, we're gonna be talking about my updated Zero Aura build. I've been running this build in Master Rank and it's been working really well for me. This build is great for jungle and laning. So, without further ado, let's get started here. First, let's talk about Zero Aura's abilities. I run Spark at level 6 and Discharge at level 8. Spark is great because it helps to chase and it does a great deal of damage. Most squishy attackers cannot run away from you even if, you use the, if they use the eject button because you have 3 charges on your spark. However, if you run Bolt Switch, they can teleport uh, port away from you and you have no other ways to chase. So Spark is extremely consistent for chasing and escaping due to having 3 charges. Plus, once you get it upgraded to Spike Plus, it will also heal you, so that makes you deceptively tanky. And of course, next we have the Discharge. This ability is great for clearing the jungle and teamfights due to its massive AoE damage potential. It's a huge power spike once you get it at level 8, and the damage is AoE so you can kill multiple pe uh, people at once, really easily, because of how strong it scales with the attack. Plus, once you get it upgraded to Discharge Plus, you will also crowd control everyone inside of it. So during a team fight, you pop this and anyone inside of it takes the damage and they get crowd control at the end of it, which makes you, you know, extremely just 1v9 jump in there. You can start a fight anytime you want. There's no reason not to use this ability because it's just amazingly good in almost every situation in the game. Alright, moving on, let's talk about the held items. First, we have the Muscle Band. This item is excellent because it provides attack and attack speed, which greatly scales with Zerora's ability and basic attack. Plus, the added bonus of dealing 3% of the enemy's remaining HP at level 20 makes you shred tanks and jungle camps extremely quickly. Overall, I think this is uh, Zerora's best damage item. There's no reason not to run this if you're playing him because he just does a lot of damage for this item. Alright, then we have the Buddy Barrier. The Buddy Barrier is just an overall great utility item because it gives a lot of HP as the base stats, so it makes you pretty tanky at the start of the game. And also it provides a 40% HP shield for 8 seconds at level 20. 8 seconds. That's crazy duration to yourself and to a teammate when you use your Ignite move. Your Unite move. So in a 2v2 situation, you're practically unkillable. This item is great for every Pokemon in the game, honestly. The utility is just insane. There's no reason not to run this item on every Pokemon in the game. Lastly, we have the Focus Band. This item is great for staying alive because it gives defense and special defense as its base stat. Uh, additionally, it heals you whenever you drop to 25% HP or below. So Zero Aura does a lot of sustain damage due to his passive and his abilities always healing him. So the longer you live, the more damage you do. This item is great to allow this kind of playstyle. Although, uh, keep in mind that the passive has a 90 second cooldown, so you can't just activate this you know, anytime you want. So, you gotta wait 90 seconds every time. Alright, next we have the battle item. I personally run Goal Getter because my Zero Aura doesn't need the eject button or X attack because I have discharge for a lot of damage and I have the spike for escape and chase, so eject button doesn't really offer too much for me. The Gold Gutter allows you to get really clutch scores in games because it speeds your scoring by twice, right? So if you have 40-50 points, stock up, there's a high chance you will complete your score with this item. Plus, you can sneak a lot of score with this item just roaming around, you know, just go from base to base and just <laughs> score, farm, score whenever this item is up. It does have a 120 second cooldown though, so you can't just pop it anytime you want. You gotta be more meticulous and plan your scores. This item is great if you enjoy scoring more than team fighting. I've used it for a while now and I can say it's really effective and can completely change a game if you can use it correctly. So there you go, that's my completed build for my Zero Aura and I'll be showcasing you guys a game in Master Tier running this build. Let's go! Alright, run it. Wow. Are you guys are top this game, not bad.
Oh, they already got it. I'm trying to find Gengar. I feel like they're gonna cast a spell here. I'm gonna follow you. Okay. I feel like in competitive, you do a shit, you're just gonna die. Yeah. Uh, wait. Right, let's go back up. So we can catch anyone. Okay. They just started one. I don't have heal. Oh, we didn't have Lucario. Oh, whatever. Get the beast, get the beast, it's ours. Get this. Yellow? Wanna oh, knock him here? Oh wow, what was that? Alright, clear. What's this? Get this crab. Oh, never mind. Oh. Wow, wow we just lost everything. You guys have to coordinate that or something. You guys want one at a time. Yeah, I went for the crap first. Yo. Yeah, this guy? I got him. Nice. Pikachu? Uh, too far. Yeah, I'm just gonna clear. You oh, guys no, chasing? Yeah, okay, I have. Okay. Wait, kill this guy too. Wait, what? No, Wait, can... what? We're the... running it? Oh, right. there are two. Kill him all. Oh. You guys got this, man. Wait. Why are you running? Alright. That sucks, they focus me first. Otherwise, I want to wipe them. Right hey, that's pretty good, though. I'm gonna I think I gotta go back in. top. There's nothing here. Oh, I already lost top. I mean, early score doesn't really matter. But to have, but it doesn't change too much. I'm trying to gank, okay? This, 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 this. We can actually kill him all here. Nice. I have 30. Get the... Clear, clear. Go up. Just get Rotom, they're jungle at the bottom. After you get Rotom, rotate for uh, Dread now. Don't, we don't need to push the Rotom. Just run down. The right time will stop for us. Charizard, don't die on us. Nine tails. Nice. <laughs> I like how Cinder is just, um, he's only one target, so he can't stop people from scoring. I know, he has to decide who he's going to stop. I don't think he has a choice. I think okay. he just hits whoever closest to him. Are you sure? On me? We're doing Dread. We're on Dread now. We'll kill him afterwards. Walking, walking. The smoke screen is so ugly. <laughs> it doesn't even do anything. Let's die, die. Die bottom. That's why it's top, we don't need to go top. Oh! <gasps> that fool's a hat. People just did a godlike stun on Let me score, let me score. I don't have anything. Oh, He stopped my score. Don't get hexed, bro! I have 40, but I think you guys gotta take it from me. Face him! Nah, this is too deep, just back up. Yeah. There's no reason yeah. to do that at all. Ah, oh, that sucks, I couldn't get a 40 off. That Gengar. I tried that he's dead. Oh wait. I have a smurf in it. I'm rotating. I'm here. Almost. I'm gonna try to score a bottom. I have goal getter. No top. Can you leave and go top? 
Yep. Uh-huh. What? Oh, there we go. Nice. Got 40 to get off. Don't force it up there all there. I... Tread now. Yep. I'm gonna go straight for it right now. I can sell it, you can stall him. Or, you can chat. They're just sitting up there, I'm not so. Okay, just come, just come for it then. You can't score anyways. I'm dead. Oh. oh, I'm still dead. I'm here. If they chase. Shit. Oh, Charizard is coming in hot. I'm trying to. I'm trying to score top here. Gotta be kind of clutch. Pikachu. I'm coming in bottom. <laughs> Top. Okay, Sam. <laughs> really just I 47 and then no R Yeah, just go top we're just gonna throw this again. Yeah. Oh, they're gonna go on us This Pikachu, okay go up go up before that thing's gone. Yeah, kill real time and then that would pretty much stop for us to do uh that those I'm gonna try to sneak 100 when Zapdos won. Yeah, you probably do it. Yeah, okay, have go get her up. Okay. Uh, you guys can hover towards Zapdos. These guys are just perma defending? I mean, I guess we win if they do that. Maybe we could just do this. Oh, huge! 100 here? You guys think uh, they're all dead. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, we're about to get so much points. There's so many points. His English is great. Okay, uh, we already scored. What's the point of being there? Oh wait, there is yeah, none. Just... And wait, this is the trolling. Oh wait, we get turned on all these kids. I'm gonna go for another score here. Me too. Woohoo! That Pikachu's trying to win, look at him. They think they're gonna win when we just scored 500. <laughs> I want some more. You want? playing Gengar, buddy? <laughs> okay, Cinder. Alright, man. <sighs> Who's defending bottom? Can you explain the Q system to me like I'm five? Just kill whatever, man. Hope nobody takes your shit. Like play Norms. <laughs> Blind pick. Whoa, he took eight points. Blind pick. Yay, we didn't throw Zapdos this game. You win. Please give me like 5 LP, at least. Wow, good job, look at our team, I told you they're not dumb, right? <laughs> 
I got 5 LP, yes! I am on my... There you go. Hopefully you enjoyed the Zero Aura gameplay. As you can see, my damage and impact around the map is quite immense with this build. I'm always pressuring and always farming to get stronger. At no point I'm just like standing still or even backing. So I'm pretty much on the map all the time doing something. If you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate that. Alright, that's all for now. Goodbye guys.